around 1.15 in the morning, she was woken up by God to pray for my protection, and she had no idea why. That's when I would finally start to pay attention. I know there's a God, but I don't know if he really exists. There's something to this God, but I, I'm still enjoying myself way too much. I was always pursuing more and trying to just keep leveling up, if you will. I'd already started tinkering with steroids and stuff like that and started getting into more of the party scene, you know, more nights of drinking, more nights of pills and, and whatnot, just to get from one high to the next. I ended up being asked to partake in Mr. Ecuador USA competition, and I ended up doing it, of course. After I won the competition, I met this other gentleman uh, from Ecuador, and he was a contestant. He ended up telling me he was a Christian, and I didn't think much of it at the time. He had asked for my keys earlier in the night. You know, that night of the competition, I'd had a few drinks. Friends just jumped into my car. I ended up on top of someone's lap on the back. I just didn't know exactly what happened. I woke up with my, my body hanging half out of the car and half in the car, and I'd realized that the two girls that were sitting there had been launched out of the car, they'd been ejected. Now it hit me, the severity of the accident. I put myself in that position, I say, well, what if I was driving? It would be an impact head on. I remember my trainer coming out of his car with his wife and creating this barrier around the actual car. He had told me later on um, that the only reason he was following me that night was because he felt compelled by God to follow me. That, that same night of the accident, another friend of mine, she tells me around 1.15 in the morning, she was woken up by God to pray for my protection. She had no idea why. Once she had told me that, that's when I would finally start to pay attention. It took a few different people that God would use to have me understand that he's been in my life the whole time working for me and not against me. Finally, it hit me that God was real. There, there, was, there was an actual God that loves us so deeply that we should be doing everything we can to glorify him and to praise him for, for always being there for us. He's the showcase, not me. Hey guys, thanks so much for following <laughs> thanks so us much for today. <laughs> Make sure you like, follow, and subscribe on Instagram, Facebook, and YouTube. And we'll see you next week <laughs> with a better dance.